Hey, what's up, guys? We've been working on the trailer, so here's a little montage. Then something bad happened. Unfortunately, we we're unable to work on our uh, 60, 65 Santa Fe trailer. We got winds, Santa Ana winds, uh, 75, 25 to 75 miles an hour. And but we got it pretty much closed off for the uh, weather for today. All right, guys, this is the uh, aftermath of the Santa Ana winds. Uh, we had winds from 26 to 75 miles per hour here. And uh, fortunately, we were able to put the uh, windows back in place. But unfortunately, Schmuck here forgot to uh, close the windows. And so, man, this place is just covered in dust. So now, now we have to clean up after the aftermath. <clears throat> Let's take a look here in the bathroom where we uh, last uh, painted the wall here. Uh, obviously, I'm going to have to go with the uh, second coat on this but the reason why is that uh, this was much cheaper to just paint this with an oil based paint um, than taking the whole thing apart and placing it with a um, with a polyurethane uh, uh, plastic uh, sheet uh, over there the, the, the time they will take to remove it to disassemble the whole thing to apply it nail it uh, in place and everything so I figured you know something it's just much cheaper to buy a, a can of uh, oil based paint and just cover this uh this uh, shower walls with the oil based paint and uh get it done and, and as as you can see it needs a second coat so that's what i'm about to uh get ready right now to do and just give it a second coat uh word of advice if you're painting if you're thinking of painting anything with the uh, oil based paint the russellian oil based paint uh please wear uh wear a mask wear some kind of filtration facial uh, mask because this the smell so strong 
when I was painting this wall, by the time I got halfway here, my eyes were watering, man, and the fumes were just so strong. So, um, but this time I have, uh, I got a mask. I don't know where it's at right now, but I, um, I got the doors open and the window behind me open as well. And we're going to start uh, giving this a second coat uh, so that we get a better coverage of it. And obviously we're painting it a nice almond color. And uh, I can't wait for you guys to see the actual color, the whole trailer that I'm going to, to paint. And it's going to look real good. Uh, this is really going to blend in with the uh, rest of the color that I'm planning on painting the, uh, the whole entire uh, travel trailer in the interior. Alright guys, here it is. Uh, came back to pick up the uh, the trailer for, that was here for one night. And uh, we're going to take it back home. I really want to give thanks to our friend uh, Leite and David who let us uh, park it here overnight uh, here at their uh, ranch. They have a very big yard and uh, so it's been uh, stored here just for one night and right now we're going to take it back to, to the house. So follow us as we go.